She's being called the DUI bride. I just want to get to my wedding. Is that your wedding dress? Yes. 32-year-old Amber Young was pulled over in Tucson, Arizona after causing a three-car crash. On the police body cam footage, you can hear her deny having any alcohol. Not anything. I, I, I've just been like very like scared about everything. After failing a field sobriety test, she was arrested for DUI. Do you think you should have been driving today? I think that I'm getting married today, and I wasn't really sure what I'm supposed to be doing today. So. It turns out her sob story about it being her wedding day was all a big, fat lie. Amber made the whole thing up. She didn't have to get to the church on time, and that white dress wasn't a wedding dress at all, just a pretty white sundress. She pled guilty and is currently on probation. I just want to get to my wedding. Speaking of brides in trouble, this bride-to-be thought she got the deal of a lifetime buying a beautiful wedding dress online. But when she got it in the mail, this is what it looked like. The bodice is completely see-through. Talk about a wedding dress fail. The side-by-side -side comparison posted on social media is drawing a big reaction. I have no sympathy for people who order their dress online. You know the risk, goes one comment. Shelly Brown, senior fashion editor at The Knot, says there are much more reliable ways to find discount dresses if you're on a tight budget. A bride can shop a sample sale. At a sample sale, you can get a wedding dress for up to 80% off, which is an amazing deal. Other options to explore? Shop at a consignment store or rent your gown. Anything to avoid a wedding dress like this.